You were looking at the people accused of vandalizing Mission San Juan, the chapel overnight. San Antonio police tweeting this video just moments ago. They say these people are responsible for writing, I don't care, do you, in spray paint. The message found in both Mission San Juan and Mission San Jose. It is the same message that was on the back of First Lady Melania Trump's jacket. She wore that jacket when boarding Air Force One on her way to the border yesterday. And today's discovery at the mission's not sitting well with San Antonians. Garrett Berger joined us live from San Juan, where workers have been cleaning up the graffiti. Garrett. Well, Steve, as you can see, this is the same angle from that video you just saw, and the graffiti all gone down. Workers have been spending the day scrubbing it off, but that actually involved taking off part of the plaster, so they'll need to put some more of that on. Now, National Park Service workers took care of the tags over at the Mission San Jose site, so all of this is gone. But no matter how temporary, the use of historic missions to make a statement didn't sit well with many folks. In big bright letters on the church at Mission San Juan and a gate at Mission San Jose, vandals spray painted the same line. I don't care. Do you? Horrible. No matter which way you you perceive it. This makes you sick inside. It's hard to say what the intended message was in the reference to the first lady's jacket. But for those who care about the missions, the message back is that the vandal or vandals chose the wrong canvas. If you think that you have some great artistic ability, then go and, and, and bloody find something else to do, you know? You know? Do something creative with it, not destructive. Father James Galvin heard people out around Mission San Juan at around 1.20 to 2.30 this morning. Though he says he hears people at night all the time. Most of the time they're out for, out for a stroll or they want to take a picture of the mission at night. But it seems whoever it was was more interested in making pictures. Both sites had additional graffiti, including this message at Mission San Jose reading expletive ice. Whatever they had to say was cleaned away within hours. And hopefully the vandal or vandals will think twice about putting it up again. Buy yourself canvas or something and put it on there or, you know, do it on your own wall. Now, though this is a national park, San Antonio police are actually helping out with the investigation, having the expertise and a property crimes unit. They tell us that these taggers could face both state and federal charges. We'll have more on the investigation coming up at 6 o'clock. Live at Mission San Juan, I'm Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News.